matrix 3 by 3. Oh, we're talking about inverse here. Okay, inverse, uh, we write this one like this one. So inverse matrix, okay, negative first power, which is, so we just find out determinant, then we times a joint, a joint matrix A. That's it. So now, okay, first step, number one, we got to find out determinant, right? Okay, now next one is a joint. A joint A. So we have three steps. Okay, one, two, three. First step, we're going to find out cofactor. Oh, we're going to talk about that one. See? Cofactor. So number two, positive, negative business. Uh huh. So every entry, they have sign value, positive or negative. Okay, number three. So we're going to find out the transpose, okay, transpose. So we're going to talk about each one, okay. Uh, what about number one, determinant? Oh, that's right. Everybody knows that one, right? Uh, right here, okay. Uh, looks like a backslash. This is going to be positive. See, positive, positive. What about four slash? Okay, so we multiply. 3, 4, 1, which is negative, negative, negative. Oh, man, most of you know this one already. Okay, so now, 2, 4, 3, oh, 24, 1, 1, 1, plus 1. Now, oh, this one has 0, so we don't have to worry about that. Now, 3, 4, 1, this way, okay, which is minus 12, okay, then 2, 1, 5, which is 10, also minus. Oh, that's it. All you have to do, what? So count, right? Okay, which is 3. That's it. That's the value of determinant. So all we have to do, just plug 3 for this D right here. Okay. For the adjoint matrix. So we're going to find out cofactor first, right? Okay, let's look at it. Cofactor. Okay, so also we can call this one minor. Okay, so major was A, which was major. Now we are looking for the minors, okay, which is, okay, minor of 2. See? Okay, 2 right there. That's minor of 2, see, which is 2 right there. Okay, that means we can write, okay, replace with cofactor, or we can call it minor. Okay, so 4, 1, 5, 3. Okay, this time we're going to pick up 1 right there. That means, oh, minor for that one is this one and this. Okay, so actually we cannot use the same row and same column of 1. That's why. Okay, so 0, 1, 1, 3. Okay, so 0, 1, 1, 3. That's it. Now, one, okay, right there. That means a minor is right here. Okay, so minor of 3. Okay, 0, 4, 1, 5. Okay, 0, 4, 1, 5. Oh, man, easy. Let's do one more. How about cofactor of 4? Okay, that means uh, this, this, and this, and this. Okay, 2, 3, 1, 3. Okay, so 2, 3, 1, 3. Okay, that's it. Then uh, we're going to calculate all these minors. Okay, so 4 times 3 this way, 4 times 3 minus 5, which is 12 minus 5, which is 7. See? Oh, right there. Okay. So what about this way? 0 times 3 minus 1, that's negative 1. See? So we're going to calculate all those. Now we're talking about, that's right, positive-negative business. Okay? So I call this one, so okay, matrix. 
Okay, each entry, they have sign value, which is, first one is positive, see? Okay, we're going to talk about that one deeper later. Okay, but next one is automatically negative, see? So I call pa, ne, pa, ne, okay, pa, ne, pa, ne. Okay, this one is negative, this is going to be positive, so on. Okay, that's why, oh, -ho, this one is a positive, that's okay. What about negative one? That's negative, see? Okay, you gotta change this sign right there. You gotta change this sign because negative. What about this one? See, this one is a positive, this one negative, right? Okay, this one, see? Oh, we gotta change all this one right here. Okay, to negative or positive. It's the opposite sign. Actually, we have new matrix just like this one. This one is not equal, so we treated this one by partner business, okay? So now, Oh, uh -huh. then we got to find out what? Oh, transpose. Oh, man, fantastic. So we have the new matrix right here, okay, after uh, what is a positive and negative treatment, right? Okay, then uh, we got to find out the transpose. Okay, transpose, very easy. So all you have to do, you just uh, exchange rows and column. That's it. Okay, just like this, okay? Then we're going to rotate this one. See? That's it. That means, oh, one goes right here, this side. Negative four goes to this side. Okay, say so one right here, negative four right there. What about this 12? See, this 12 goes to right here. Okay, so on. Okay, so actually we're going to have, after transpose, you're going to usually we put T on the top right hand side, just like that. This is it. This is the uh, joint A. Uh -huh. So now all you have to do, you just multiply 1 over 3 right there. Okay. So that means each one, uh -huh, 7 over 3. What about the next one? 1 over 3. Okay. What about uh, negative 4 over 3? Okay. So this is 1 third over 12, 4. Okay, 3 divided by 3 is going to be 1. Negative 9 over 3, negative 3. Okay, 8 over 3, 8 over 3. Okay, negative 2 over 3, 8 over 3. Wow, finally we have the inverse matrix. That's it. Now, you just multiply matrix and inverse matrix. It's going to be just like this. It, this one should be like this shape, right? Okay, 1, 1, 1, then 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. So this one should be 1. That's why we call this one what? That's right, identity matrix. Right there, that's it.